I think there's always something about Christmas that gets us tingly. Everyone has their crazy lives, all these situations, but the holidays really bring people close together. You never know what you're gonna get with the coterie. It's always something new. Hey, have you seen Mariana? No. Wait, uh, if you see her, tell her I'm gonna kill her. You've got vendors and uh, a Christmas carnival and dinner parties and potentially some furry four-legged friends running around the place. We usually shoot pretty separately, so the great thing about the holiday episodes is that the Coterie family really got to spend time together every single day of those episodes. I love you all so much. I love your moms. I'm such a fan of the entire Adams Foster family. You know, we worked with them last season, and I'm so excited that they're back. The good I stole. Is that weed? Oh, it's a dope goofball. <laughs> I saw Jude. And, you know, from the very first episode that he was on, he was so little, and then seeing him at the table read, he's tall, and you're just like, dude, you're so big. Uh, where have you been? Nowhere. Just seeing them, it, it feels like that's our heartbeat and our core and our kind of, it is our genesis. And I think it's, it's just good for Malika to be around such a beautiful uh, family. I do love the fact that holidays involve food, and a lot of food, because that's like my favorite thing. Um, besides my mom. My favorite tradition is to spend time with my mom and watch The Preacher's Wife. Have yourself a merry little Christmas. I guess when I was younger, my mom really would go all out to be Santa Claus. And like, oh, it's gonna make me cry thinking about it. Cause she would like always, she like never took credit for it. She's the best. The holidays are really special and Holidays at the Coterie are even more special. Let's just make sure this is the best Christmas ever. <laughs> One for the books.